Hello, hello, and welcome back to the Clash of Clans video. But this one's a little bit different. I'm not. It's not an episode. I'm telling you guys, right? When you when someone's attacking your village, I want to let you guys know how you can save five hundred. Oh no, yeah, six hundred fifty-four thousand elixir. Or 564, I, I did the calculations but I kind of forgot. And over 5,000 Dark Elixir, which is crazy from defense. And you know, if you're saving up for something in, in, the, in the laboratory and all these are expensive, like if you're saving up for this Dragon 7 million, then it shouldn't be as hard. Obviously, you still lose a lot of Elixir once you get attacked, but you know, you can still save like 600 or 564,000, which is, I mean, it's better than nothing. I mean, at this town hall level, at my troop levels and everything, this is how much you're going to save. Obviously, in town hall 10, you're going to save a lot more, and I will tell you why. So first things first, make sure your army is trained. And now, forget about that. You don't really care about your army. Just make sure it's trained and you're done. Next, go into your barracks, and the most expensive thing here is these three. And look at my elixir. As I, as I train them, it's going down a lot. So there we go, all those. Then go in here and do this one, just because it's really expensive. And as you upgrade it, obviously, every, all the other spells are going to get more and more expensive. If there's one more expensive than the rage spell, just put that. And as you can see, already it's 397,000. And that's how much the the attacker will see when he attacks me. And then there's like what? He gets a, a percentage of that. So if I have like um, 100,000, he's only going to be able to take 20,000. So that's that's actually quite good. Instead of being able to take over 120,000 from me, he's only going to be taking maybe 70 or 80,000, which, which saves me a lot. It really does. And then for the Dark Elixir, as you can see, just do these three golems. And in Town Hall 10, you can upgrade this one more time and you can obviously save a lot more dark elixir because it's more expensive and then in here do the earthquake spell or whichever one's more expensive that's basically what you have to do and the reason i said make sure troops are trained is because as you can see these things are training up right now okay and if you if you, this isn't trained if this isn't um full then what happens is that they train and then they go into your army camps but because it's full once these are trained it just stops and it says the camp army camps are too full and at that point, make sure you don't donate anything with 30 spaces or 25 spaces at least. Do not donate. Otherwise, the ones, the, the troops that are trained in here and say the 43 minutes are up, they're already fully trained. Then as soon as there's 25 spaces available, it's going to go into your army camps and it's going to take all the elixir that you put into it. And then after the attack, after someone attacks you and raids you and they steal whatever elixir there is, then come back in here, just remove all these, and as you can see, everything else goes back up. The best thing about this is that it's not like when you're spending gold and on a building, and then you want to cancel the building, and it only gives you 50% of your gold back. This gives you everything. So as you can see, it just goes all the way up, and yeah, you just get everything back. And you look from 961,000 elixir down to 300,000, which is sick. It's, it's really, really cool. And um, just to show you guys how well it went, right? This is a screenshot. I, I actually took a screenshot. I had 865,000 elixir on me at the time. And then I did this trick. And as you can see from here, boom, there was only 31,000 I was going to lose. From 800,000 elixir, and only he he could only take 31,000. And if I let, and but when I when I took it all off, when I took all the when I did this trick and uh, trained this army, what happened is it went down all the way to around 100 or to 300,000, and that's the only amount he could take. If it was at 800,000, that would definitely be at 80,000 or even 100,000, depending on the town hall level. So yeah, I'm really happy with that. It's, it's a neat trick. I'm not saying I found it or anything. I mean, I just thought of it, and I thought, why not? And, you know, it works. And for the gold, there isn't really anything, unless you want to spend it on a building or something, and you don't mind getting only half of it back, half of the gold back when you cancel it. Yeah, otherwise it's mainly for the elixir and the dark elixir. And it's a little bit tedious. If I was you guys and I wasn't attacking for the day, like just say this was my final raid that I'm going to do. Or just say this thing here was my final raid, didn't want to do any more. For the day, I'm done, I'm going to go sleep. The shield's going to go out in an hour and I'm going to go to sleep. So just quickly train this army up and then go to sleep. I mean, it is a little bit tedious, but like I said, it, it's worth it. It really is. So yeah, anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope it, hopefully it helps. I mean, if you didn't know it, then you do now. And if you did know it, then, I mean, you won't learn anything new. So <laughs> anyway, guys, we're going to the video. I'm Perfect Lion and I'll see you guys later.